In China, Prime Minister Kakar had a busy day. He chaired a roundtable meeting on the China-Pakistan Economic Corridor and spoke about the importance of strong friendship, mutual cooperation and respect between China and Pakistan. Both countries have agreed to transform CPEC into a project of prosperity, employment and sustainable development. The caretaker Prime Minister also met with Russian President Vladimir Putin and discussed their shared stance on countering terrorism. Energy is concerned. I think so. We are an energy deficient country. We are a people, population of almost 240 million people. Uh, we, in our itself, it's, it's a huge market. And uh, well, we do understand our energy minister just attended uh, Energy Week in Russia uh, with very fruitful and constructive engagement from uh, the, your side and the team has come for some concrete proposals. The Prime Minister established future cooperation in the field of education and research between China and Pakistan and said Pakistan values exchanges with China in all sectors. Also met with the President of Kenya, Dr. William Ruto, and both leaders agreed to enhance cooperation in trade, investment, education and collaboration. The Prime Minister also requested assistance in expediting the Joint Investigation Team's report on the killing of senior journalist Arshad Sharif in Kenya. Prime Minister Kakar participated in the third Belt and Road Forum for International Cooperation hosted by Chinese President Xi Jinping. He attended a gala dinner at the Great Hall of the People in Beijing with other global leaders. President Xi Jinping and the First Lady welcomed him upon his arrival in Beijing. The gala dinner was attended by leaders from Russia, Kenya, Ethiopia, Mongolia, Hungary, Sri Lanka, Kazakhstan, Uzbekistan and other international dignitaries. The caretaker PM also had informal meetings with some of these global leaders during the gala dinner in Beijing.